What's up, my fellow RV lifestyle enthusiasts, RV lifestyle guru, John Kersbergen, standing outside Pete's RV, South Burlington, Vermont, standing in front of one of the hottest floor plans in the nation right now. It's a J-Flight SLX 2017 267 BHSW. It's a double bunk in the back. Uh, great for families, obviously. Under 6,000 pounds, okay? So we're very fortunate to have these in here in Vermont. We invested very heavy in the Jayco product and particularly this floor plan right here. So we'll start up front. Um, basically right here, you're gonna get 20 pound propane tanks with this one and a new deep cycle battery. And we have the uh, diamond plate rock guard right here as well. That's gonna protect you know, that front cap, that aluminum for getting kind of dense in it as you drive down the road. And then it's tough to see here, but what really separates Jayco from the competition is the detail in their construction. So this is an integrated A-frame. So what this means is this frame passes right through the main beam of the frame for the rest of the trailer essentially reduces buckling okay so that's a normal issue with travel trailers is buckling you're pulling different components this is integrated into the frame better um, base layer it's gonna make everything else going up better as well we'll uh, swing around the front here and check out this pass-through storage here as well nice finished out plywood again that's Jayco quality it goes all the way through, also accessible on that uh, other side. You know, one thing you can't really see, it's that, uh, I mean, Jayco uses a little bit thicker aluminum than, than the competition. It's 0 .024 as opposed to 0 .016. Um, you know, the roof system on here, Magnum Trust roof system, this roof holds 4,500 pounds. The competitors, they don't put a number on what it holds, but Jayco's outlasted theirs by 1,000 pounds in testing, okay? <laughs> This one comes with a power awning, touch of a button, you're gonna have your awning there. Real easy, I'll show you that real quick. Standing right up here, awning right here, gonna go. Easy in and out, all right, touch of a button there. Automotive lights, we got Perion marine grade outdoor speakers, okay? We have tinted safety glass windows. That's gonna prolong the life of your furniture even. You're not gonna have that sun beating down on it all, all uh, summer long. Got some nice TV hookups you want to do that as well. And then, yeah, just take a nice look at it. 267, about 30 feet with including the hitch. You have a spare tire here as well. We'll head inside. So again, this product is under 6,000 pounds. Very, very towable, especially with that integrated A-frame system here. So head into the kitchen, you're gonna notice LED lights, push of a button right there. Very easy to work with. Nice counter space here. You got a high rise faucet and a split sink. I don't know who does dishes in your family, but I find because I do my own dishes all the time and my own laundry. And, uh, you know, just, I'm on my own out here in Vermont, all right? And basically, it's a lot easier to clean, not clean, dry, not dry. I mean, it's just sim simplicity. A lot, of a lot of trailers at this price point just have one big sink. Kind of complicates things a little bit. Got those high point microwave, again, for the RV industry. Specifically made here. Three burner stove here. A nice little oven. And then Norco refrigerator here, RV style. Gas and electric, separate fridge and freezer. Very nice finish here. One thing I noticed here, the craftsmanship, it's, they use real plywood on these, they use real wood on the front. So you can reach around here, look at these closures. This uh, particular model is in the smoke decor. And then lots of storage here as well. Just take a peek in that. I mean, I got fairly long arms here. I can get my full arm in there. And then the bunks back here as well. So these are the Teddy Bear bunk series. Hold 600 pounds on this bunk right here, okay? I mean, you can fit a few kids up there if you need to. No problem with that. Take a peek in the bathroom. Foot flush toilet there. Skylight. One thing that's unique about the, the Jayco structure is they have actually have a plywood platform underneath the base of the tub and the showers. So, I mean, if you're walking around here, it's not going to be, you're not going to feel soft spots. You're not going to be able to be able to like break through that or have it get, um, you know, create creases down the line, things like that. It's a very sturdy structure. They, uh, Really take the time and add those little extra elements in there as well. So again, extra sleeping space here. We've got the booth style dinette. This table will drop down into a bed. 
pull the cushions in. And then right here we got the jackknife sofa. So just futon style. Additional sleep space as well. Play it here to the back, or excuse me, the bedroom. So again, like I mentioned, you can access that storage from underneath here, just in right here. In and out, real simple. It's a Simmons mattress here as well. It's a nice, comfortable, firm mattress, residential style. Again, camping made easy. Again, uh, this is John over at Pete's RV Center on uh, South Burlington, Vermont. We're selling these units all over the country. Feel free to give me a call. If you're not shopping Pete's RV Center, you will pay too much for your next J-Flight SLX 267. Thanks for watching. Take care.